हाई व्यूवर्स वेलकम टू हिली वर्सोल थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग सो टूडेज टॉपिक इज वॉट यू आर लिविंग बिहैंड इन दिस ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू ओके वेन यू आर एंटरिंग इन टू ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री वॉट यू आर बी लिविंग बिहैंड इन यूर लाइफ यू एंटर इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू विल बिकम यूर पास्ट सो वॉट पास्ट यू आर लिविंग यूर बिहैंड सो इट्स अ पी के पाई लिविंग यू नीड टू चूज वन कार्ड which ever you are drawn towards but it is leaving behind so i think you can go for multiple piles but watch the piles take between the piles take it small break okay don't watch continuous you will get confused or your energy get disturbed okay so let's get into the reading pile number 1 which is red pile So, pile number one. What you are leaving behind in this 2022? How many days left? I think 22 days, 23 days, ah, 20 days. Hardly, hardly 15 to 20 days left. So, what you are leaving behind in 2022? The hero friend. So, pile number one, who choose red pile? Here the zodiac signs are: Hero of Taurus, Six of Wands, Leo, and Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords, Gemini. Okay, Gemini. Yeah, yes, Gemini. So here, Taurus, Leo, Gemini. These signs may be somewhere in your chart. Existed are mostly dominated by these charts. You are chart picks, okay? So here, what you are leaving behind is, I think you are a married person. If at all, two scenarios, okay? Because here of ending like a traditional card. Mostly we see it as a marriage, wedding, or in other way, very traditional card. So you may be following very traditions, or you may be following some kind of traditions which you are. family is following from very long and you are also till now you are also following the same traditions norms rules and all so here in 2022 you are living these traditions in 2023 you are not carrying this tradition two scenarios here if at all you are married person you are living this marriage in 2022 either you are ending up this relationship traditional relationship marriage or it is as simple as it is a traditional family or you yourself is a very traditional person who you want everything in the traditional way then in 2022 you are living that traditional belief systems okay either marriage or traditional belief systems you are living those traditional kind of energy which is very tradition very conservative conventional following each and every norms at least like listening to your elders into in the home okay even though they are whatever they are telling it is not good for you still you are listening because because it's, it is our tradition to listen into the elders and uh, uh, following their guidance even though it is not serving us in this era as simple as it is okay uh, uh, it is right see my mom will tell me Girl, uh, women or girls should be wake up in the five o'clock, six o'clock. But when I wake up, yeah, it's thirty nine o'clock. So she every day tell that you should wake up at six o'clock, five o'clock, six o'clock. It is from my childhood. <laughs> Forty one years, nothing changed. Everything will be same. But she is habituated to tell those things, and I am also habituated to listen those things. But I won't do anything because I will do what I want to do. I won't fall, but maybe you are the person who used to fall. So now, as simple as it is, just you maybe used to listen that uh, we need to wake up in the five o'clock. We need to. Uh, in, they will be having some traditional things which we need to follow. So maybe till now you are follow twenty twenty two, but in the twenty twenty three you are not going to. Be. You are leaving all those things in the twenty two. We don't 
uh, I actually I don't want to take 2023 name so I just want to end it in the 2022 only. So here you are leaving that uh, traditional systems whatever you may be following till now. Okay? So that kind of norm, small small also as I said how moms will behave. Okay? how they desire our wishes okay that things you are anyway till now you may be followed i did not follow it <laughs> you are following it so now you are going to leave it in 2022 you are leaving the traditional norms rules regulations and all if any other cases if at all you are a married person you are leaving that marriage okay and six of wands so you are leaving some kind of success Maybe wherever you are, there may be a successful career, a successful relationship, successful family, successful uh, place, whatever it may be. In 2022, you are leaving that place. It is a successful, it is a great thing. You got some kind of victory. People see you as an inspiration person. People take you as a, uh, and that is what, in, inspiration person. They see your success. They want to become like you. Because six of vans very passionate person, very confident person, you want to do something, not just do, you achieve so many things maybe, because six of so Vance is like a winner, winner, achiever, so you achieve so many things in your life, this card is like one kind of achievements, so you are leaving those achievements, anything that can be, see here, hierophant came out, here some kind of success achievement came out, so it may be successful relationship, maybe till now, that relationship may be very successful, but you may be leaving those successful relationships. Or simply that family traditions, whatever you are following, maybe that is one way you may be thought that it is successful. You, they, they gave you some kind of success following these traditions, norms and all, gave you some kind of success. So till now you followed that. And till now you got that achievements because of following that norms and all. as simple as like you may be head of some kind of religious institution because hierophant is one kind of job when it comes to job career related you may be head of the uh, head of some kind of religious institution and there you got so many achievements as a head of that guru kind of energy so guru kind of place position you got so many achievements you did so many things you uh, said so many like you guided so many people you gave a lot of suggestions you gave a lot of advices uh, so you got a lot of achievements in that area of success area of profession you got success in that now in 2022 you are leaving those things in this 2022 you are leaving these things maybe you may be going to choose some other career or if it is relationship, you are simply leaving that relation. If it is jobs, you are simply leaving. And one more thing is nine of swords energy. Maybe because of this success, because of these traditions, you maybe got so many anxiety kind of energy. Because nine of swords is completely anxiety, sleepless nights, nightmares. Because this success, these traditions, maybe as I said, your family may be traditional family. So when you you, you uh, when you are a kid, you brought up with the traditional belief systems. Okay, till some age, till some extent, it will be good because we won't be having our own desires, our own wishes. So it will be good to follow all those things, listening to parents, listening to elders, following God. But certain time will come, there we start thinking about ourselves. Then everything will crumble. Like you may be very traditionally following all those things, but somewhere something happened you start thinking in a different way like you want to be unconventional you want to go out have fun having friends having parties something different because this traditional is something different where your parents maybe won't allow you to go out but you want to go out you want to wear very uh, modern clothes but it is a very traditional family your family is not allowing to wear all those things and moreover, if at all you are a guru kind of position, obviously you cannot do some things even though you want to do. <laughs> Maybe you got success in that. As a guru, you may be achieved so many things. Maybe people maybe people appreciated you, they gave awards, rewards, recognition, you got everything. That is also the six of hands is some kind of recognition, some kind of success, some kind of achievements. You got everything. But the thing is, 
here you are simply following your family norms rules regulations traditions that's why you got all these things but certain time came out and you thought that you may be having some other desires internally as a person as a individual you have different desires and when you are you want to pursue your desire this traditions this success everything is coming into the way and what will happen this anxiety will happen because your mind your heart wants something your people around you want something <laughs> or at least whatever your heart desires you cannot do that because of your position because of your situation that is nothing but it will create lot of anxiety because you don't know what to do you want to leave this but if you leave it is a very successful position success lot of achievements lot of recognition lot of rewards there is so much a name fame so you don't you don't want to leave it but if at all you don't want to leave it you want to be in this position you will have that name fame everything but your heart is still wanting something you are you always feel that lack of satisfaction even though you are a successful person still for the people you may look like a very successful person but internally you know that you lack something you are not completely satisfied because you are not doing what you are heart desire your heart is truly desiring then this nine of swords will come out you cannot sleep at night you won't be having that peacefulness you feel anxiety because you don't know what is happening because your intuition your heart always try telling you to do something what is good for you but here you are doing what is good for others either it may be your family either it may be your relationship either it may be your job you are simply following those things which are good for others not for you maybe you don't want all these things you want simply what your heart is truly desire but here you are doing all these things because people are giving lot of uh, recognition you got some name you got some kind of authority or this is honorable position you don't want to lose it because so many people are honoring you it is like conflicts kind of thing that that's way this nine of swords is like not sleeping having lot of anxiety stress nightmares some kind of fears what fear see is like you are a traditional person your heart desire something you want to do something so there is a fear fear of the can i it is like what if i do if i do i will get caught up if i get caught up i am going to lose all these things that kind of fear there is nothing but this nine of swords having lot of anxiety and all so finally in 2022 you are leaving everything because i think here you are continuing same thing from very long because nine of before nine of swords eight of swords will come stuck position where you need to decide what you want but because of this old belief systems you did not decide it. you want to stuck in that position that's what it became nightmare that position itself will become nightmare either it is a relationship that relationship will become a nightmare the success will become a nightmare so once upon a time it is a good for you now it became a nightmare i hope you understand so that's how it became nine of swords so now what you will do you need to leave it because you cannot live with the nightmare you know that it is a nightmare in the maybe in the past it is a good thing for you but now it became a nightmare nightmare so that is also one reason so here it is like you are leaving this anxiety this whatever it is traditions relationship success whatever you are leaving everything because these things are literally bringing you this nightmares nine of swords in it not letting you to sleep in the night what is the use of doing all those things when you can't sleep peacefully in your life what is the use of doing so maybe you realized it that is also one reason in the 2022 you are completely living uh, this traditional thing whatever it may be this uh, success this anxiety <laughs> whatever anxiety it is coming from this two things okay either it may be relationship either it may be honorable position that success those things became nightmare to you now so that is also one reason you decided to leave it that's a good thing choose what is right for you not what is right for other people okay even though it is our family <laughs> let's move on to file number 2 so file number 
Pile number two, what you are leaving behind in 2022, 2022. Knight of Sun card, happiness, Knight of Pentacles, stability, honesty, reliableness, Ace of Cups, self-love, mud fucking thing you are. So pile number two, who chose green pile? I think your favorite color is a green. <laughs> Because Knight of Nine of Knight of Pentacles also not a very stable card, but they like green. Okay, so maybe you choose green. You may be a green lover. At least you love green color. So what you are leaving behind in 2022? So here in 2022 you are leaving the Sun card. That is that means happiness. Why you are leaving your happiness? Here all are good cards. Why you are leaving good things in your life? Maybe you are, you need to go through some kind of karma. Because these are blessings. Whatever you are leaving behind in 2022, these are blessings. So, anyway, see, the sun card, it is a very happy. It is like whatever making you happy in your life. Till now, it is. it made you like a small kid. It brought you happiness in your life. Lot of happiness in your life. Not just small happiness. Lot of happiness, lot of satisfaction, lot of positivity, lot of confidence. You felt like you are a kid, newborn kid, without any tensions, without any negativity, without any toxicity. It is completely a sun card, new beginning. That's what I said, new things, fresh. You are living those things. I don't know what it is. It may be job, it may be person, it may be relationship. It may be like your kid. Maybe you are moving towards some distance place, so you are leaving that kid. Anything, okay? Which made you, which is very fresh, which made you very happy. You became like a kid again. And uh, so you are leaving this sun. Knight of Pentacles, second. I think you may be a very honest person, very reliable person, very trustworthy person who seek for opportunities or who ready to give up like who ready to have partnerships this knight of pentacle is ready to work with others they won't work alone they are ready to they are ready for the partnerships they are ready to work with the people around them whoever talented people intelligent people and they think that they are trustworthy because this knight of pentacle also very trustworthy person they are not as stable as a king of pentacle but still they are trustworthy person, grounded person. That's why I said you may be a green color, lover of green color. Okay, maybe you love green color. So you are living those things. Maybe that's what I said. Maybe it is like you may be you need to be going to some kind of karma, whatever it may be. Because here all it is like a blessing. Maybe you have some other destination in 2023. So here you are living this partnership or at least even if at all you are like a knight of pentacle you are living that honesty you are living that reliableness you are living that uh, having partnership with others in work related areas and all you don't want any kind of partnerships and all okay i think it is you not anyone because self-love card also came out maybe anyway take the messages as it resonates if at all someone in your life like this like it, it may be your partner because knight of pentacle is very much interested in partnerships so you are leaving that partner okay maybe this par partner is your uh, it is like one one other sin scenario is like this partner may be your business partner as well as your partner and this partner brought a lot of happiness in your life or at least you will be very happy with this partnership whether it is in the business sense whether it is in the personal relationships okay and uh, it is like they showed a lot of love. See, when Ace of Cups comes, it is not that love kind of energy, the intimacy kind of energy. It is like loving, showing a lot of love, unconditional love, compassion, and that kind of energy. That can be come from your family members, partners, even with our pets. Okay? So here, maybe this person showed you a lot of love. Take the messages as it resonates. Because... Okay, because it can be two scenarios. It can be you or it can be someone else in your life. Okay. Because here I don't think that you are going to become disloyal, dishonest, dis unreliable person. 
until unless you want to destroy yourself completely otherwise <laughs> it is just some kind of person in your life who is like your partner maybe you are doing business with that partner maybe it is like knight of pentacles is doing business with them which is very stable not very grounded but stable so maybe now the things are not working so that is also one reason maybe you are leaving this partner but in this partnership you you got lot of love lot lot of love and lot of happiness so now in 2022 you won't be having this partnership you are leaving this uh, 20, next year okay next year you won't be having this partnership because you are leaving this partnership behind in 2022 you are leaving this partnership it may be brought lot of happiness lot of like unconditional love but maybe you may be having some other options or other destiny maybe you may be having you are you may be meeting your emperor okay because it is a business partnership just so you may be meeting your emperor you may be becoming empress because green green is nothing but empress card right like stable stability grounding card so any cases i don't think here you are becoming unreliable untrustworthy kind of energy because here there is no negative cards that's why i don't i am not telling if at all it is other negative cards that is fine maybe someone in your life it is completely like a partnership kind of energy because knight of pentacle not a very stable long term partnership it can, it is having potential to stable stability but maybe as i said you got some other opportunity better than this nothing but that you may be got opportunity from the emperor because it is a knight of pentacle emperor is different even king of pentacle <laughs> you may be got opportunity in some other business partnership where it is better than this business whatever you are doing currently now that is also one reason you want to leave it maybe in this partnership you got lot of happiness lot of positivity you may be not took much uh, responsibilities in this partnership because the sun card is like a kid this person whomever you are partnered with they took all the responsibilities you just simply enjoyed it uh, just you enjoyed you happily enjoyed your life or you just uh, it is like simply happiness just uh, enjoyed the life that's it even though if it is a partnership you just enjoyed the life and uh, you got unconditional love because ace of cups is some kind of love but here i only one cup is there. so that is also one reason maybe you are not interested or you gave this they are not interested two cases so you are leaving all these things you don't want okay even though it is a good things but as i said maybe you are getting better opportunity because you are a stable person grounded person maybe more than grounded this knight of pentacle you may be more grounded than this knight of So that is also one reason. Maybe you are getting some other opportunity, and you are leaving these things. Even though if it is a beautiful things, like a blessing kind of energy, but it is a still night. Maybe you want something stable. It is good, but the thing is here, you are like a kid only. You cannot mature or grow up. And it is one cup, only one cup. How many? How many years you will leave? You are going to leave with one cup. You need other cup also. Like you want to enter in that. uh intimacy kind of relationships which is two of cups the deep connections feelings so that is also one reason maybe here you are offering one cup even though it is a very beautiful happiness lot of happiness is there but here this person maybe just uh, they are worried about pentacles because knight of pentacle is not a loving card it is pentacle card they they are reliable honest trustworthy faithful <laughs> everything will be there and then there is no love they only talk about business So maybe now you want love. Uh, in the past, it may be like it kept you like a kid. So that time it is okay, but it is not giving you two cups you need. That deep feelings. Maybe that is also one reason. Maybe it is a good thing, but still you are leaving. Maybe you are meeting your soulmate, or you are simply getting married with someone who can give you that happy family. So let's move on to pile number three. Who chose white pile? So pile number three. What you are leaving behind in this 2022? Ending the cycle. It's a great thing. We need to end the cycles. Then only we can move forward. Hmm. Good things are leaving, but nice good things. <laughs> That's what actually. 
good things are living when you are living behind which you need to be live live those things you are living that's that's why i said it is a good things you are living so here the zodiac signs are leo taurus scorpio aquarius okay so and uh, this sagittarius and leo okay sagittarius leo leo is strong and scorpio is strong because seven of cups also scorpio leo scorpio is very strong you are chart may be very much dominated by leo and scorpio so here what you are leaving behind in 2022 i think you are ending some cycle in your life whatever cycle you may be whether it may be good cycle whether it may be bad cycle whether it may be karmic cycle you are leaving that ending that cycle okay that cycle is ended you are leaving behind that cycle okay you are also accepted if at all in the past you were not accepted you are accepting that that cycle is ended now you need to leave it Okay, in 2022 itself, you are understanding <laughs> because some people I will get some clients. I will tell them how many time, times I may pull the card. Cycle will come in the reverse. I told them you need to end this cycle. They still come with the same problem and tell that what I need to do. End the cycle. They will again come. They will same thing. I will tell. You. They will also same thing. They will do. How many times I may tell? They won't. It is like some kind of stubborn nature, or some kind of attachment. They don't know how to detach the things fastly. But here, I think you are good at detaching, or at least you may be struggled in the completely twenty twenty to leave this cycle. So finally, in the twenty twenty two, it may came upright. Okay, so that case also there. So here, finally, you are understanding that cycle is over. You need to leave it. So in the twenty twenty two. you are leaving that cycle completed cycle you are leaving you may be moving to some other city some other location you are traveling to some other location or you are simply changing your home wherever you are living place okay when i say traveling moving to some other place as simple as you may be living in the some um, home you may be changing other home okay that is also kind of travel it is not that you need to travel 100 200 km simply when you wherever you are living you are not no more living in that place you are ch- changing to some other place that is also like changing location kind of energy okay so here that those things are happening one is cycle is ended second thing is you are moving somewhere okay you are not going to stay in the same place even if you are having plans or not you are leaving that things because cycle is ended you are moving to some other the travel is there that's it this world is travel and you you may be having this king of wands energy in your life it is like a father figure or husband mostly it is husband kind of energy king of wands is husband energy so you may be leaving your husband oh, why this cycle is ended means maybe it is like you are ending the marriage yeah king of wands is see two things is there king itself is a father figure so either if at all you are already married person you are ending some marriage and you are leaving that marriage okay you are leaving that husband that is also one reason maybe you are changing to other location or if at all it is your father figure but mostly king of wands is husband only but anyway you take the messages as it resonates if at all it is a father figure also as i said you are leave, ending some cycle so you need to travel in the next cycle you are going to move towards somewhere uh, some other place location so that is also one reason you are leaving this king of wands also we have in the 2022 but here i am sensing <laughs> it is like even if at all you are a male person same thing will be like you are ending some cycle maybe it is marriage or if, if at all you have any kind of partnership like mm, romantic partnerships because king of wands will be like a husband but it cannot be a traditional marriage husband maybe it is a romantic partner who is well matured person okay so that is that maybe you are living that and uh, why i said is seven of cups came out means lot of opportunities 
and here in the world card one beautiful woman is there so maybe you are a, whomever watching you may be a very beautiful woman who had a relationship with this king of wands in the they are like a husband but maybe it is passionate way okay maybe they are maybe your husband or the way as simple as sexual partner okay maybe you may be dealing with this person finally that cycle is ended and you also accepted that cycle is ended and you are moving towards somewhere because you are no more living with this person you are living <laughs> leaving this person behind and this cycle behind and uh, i think you had lot of options when you are with this person it is like an abundant life because seven of cups is like a one kind of abundant having lot of choices having lot of options like uh, everything whatever you want in your life this person is king of wands king energy so they can buy you anything that's why i said it may be it i am not completely sensing it is a husband but it is like sugar daddy <laughs> okay <laughs> because i am not sensing here completely traditional marriage wife and husband because it is not a divorce card it is not two of cups in the reverse it is not other it is simply ending the cycle so you may be in the relationship with someone who is like uh, living in kind of energy sexual partner okay now you are living that person with that person maybe in this cycle with that person you may be had lot of options or lot of abundance like whatever you want you can get it kind of energy okay maybe they are rich or wealthy some kind of power they may be holding that is also one reason they provided every as simple as they are in the father figure you are a very young beautiful girl so they will buy you anything whatever you want that's why i said maybe sugar daddy okay you are living that person whomever they may be whether it may be husband whether it may be sugar daddy okay take the messages as it resonates don't get triggered okay <laughs> so you are living all these things maybe that's why why i am again and again telling sugar daddy a uh, 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 sexual partner please here i'm not seeing any reason to leave if at all it is a marriage maybe now you want something different in your life because even though you have lot of abundance when the, when you are with this person still you are confused still you are confused you are not satisfied that is also one reason why maybe this person is a sugar daddy they 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 are ready to give everything they are ready to fulfill all your wishes because seven of cups is like giving everything materialistically whatever if you want to go somewhere they will take you they will give you big mansion they will give you money they will give you gold and diamonds they will show you colorful things but the thing is what you are seeking for maybe they are not giving so that is also one reason you were living this behind this cycle is ended finally and uh, you are accepted that you are closing this cycle and even though there is so many opportunities with this person when you are with this person there are so many opportunities for you but still you don't know what to do or at least what you need to choose you are feeling like stuck or you are simply not satisfied what you are getting so it is like you want to move now so you are leaving all those things even though it is little see it is not uh, as i said i always say seven of cups is one kind of distraction okay here you can do anything the world card the beautiful women who can do anything they don't need anyone to fulfill your wishes you don't need anyone you can have anything young guy is there so you can get handsome guys okay you bull is there that means very stubborn you can get whatever you want you can achieve it taras stubborn person who can achieve whatever they want scorpio leo very courageous person they don't need anyone to come and support them motivate them and scorpio they can be as secret is as the scorpio can be they no need to reveal everything so it is complete the world card itself is a complete so i think as a person you are a complete person maybe in this cycle you did not realize it. that is also one reason you thought that this king of wands is giving everything and that is also one reason even though you have the seven of cups you never satisfied with all those things because in this seven of cups you did not find yourself i hope you are understanding they may be providing everything but you lost yourself because here the world card the woman is very much free 
because she herself is a complete lady see whoever you may be whether you may be male or female energy is feminine energy okay so this world itself is a complete card so here you don't need someone to complete you even even though this person is giving lot of things for being with them you are losing your freedom simply at least you are feeling like you are stuck in some way because this window you are captured in this window like you captured in one photo frame you cannot come out of that photo frame okay so it is like completely it is not that they are controlling because king of hands is not a controlling card but it is like you cannot be yourself that is also one kind of control it is not that you need to do that you need to do when we are not exploring ourselves that is also one kind of control we are self sabotaging ourselves or as simple as that's why i said when everything you are getting freely you don't know what is your own strength maybe here in your case same thing is happening because you are a very beautiful girl and energy so because of your young energy beautiful lady this king of hands is like a old person they are like a father figure old person and uh, having you is the blessing for them they don't need anything having this young beautiful girl beside them is enough for them but here you are losing your you not losing it is like you are forgetting your own worth you, you became maybe you became like a status symbol just having beautiful some people will be there uh, they will be very old but they will keep young girls beside them to show status symbol like see i can have young girls that girls don't have their self worth see i don't want to judge anyone they have their own problems to be like that maybe here you realize it that you realize your self worth you understood your power because your work are complete you yourself complete you don't need anyone maybe you realize it that that is also one reason you don't want to be status symbol for this person anymore that is also one reason even though you have lot of opportunities when you are with this person you don't want all those things what is the use of all having all those things when you don't have your own self worth so maybe that is also one reason you are closing this cycle you are accepting this cycle and you are moving towards your next new year with yourself it's a great thing we should know our worth it is a good thing someone having someone paying our bills being a sugar daddy but meanwhile we will forget our own abilities our own power <laughs> here i am not telling that no it is like see here i am not telling that you should not be in the partnership you should be in the partnership but the with the person who appreciate your partnership who appreciate your worth not the person who think that you are like a status symbol so having you as their status symbol that is not the right thing because we are not an object we whether it may be female or male because some females are so there they will do with same thing with the men so anyone we should know our self worth we should not become one object it is our responsibility so let's move on to pile number 4 which is the love pile so pile number 4 what you are leaving behind in 2022 king of cups 10 of pentacles ace of swords So by number four, who chose ten of pile? So here the zodiac signs: Pisces, King of Cups is Pisces, Ten of Pentacles is Virgo, Ace of Swords is Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. <laughs> It is like so. What we are leaving behind? I think here King of Cups energy. One person who is like a father figure, they want to offer you a cup of love, or they are treating you like a father figure. they want to take care of you like a father figure so here you are leaving that person you don't want their love take care whatever it may be okay 
and you are living this ten of pentacles maybe they have so much wealth or they have some kind of big organization which is like generational wealth kind of thing. maybe this person is a very rich person very wealthy person very what it is like well known person in the society so here you are leaving all these things behind and days of sorts some kind of new beginning maybe you have chance to let's see pile number 4 you have a chance to new beginning to have this new beginning with this king of cups energy who is like father figure very loving caring nurturing person who don't involve in fights and all they solve the things very calmer way or i can say sit and talk okay don't fight sit and talk my brother is there he don't fight i am very like a fighter he will sit and talk <laughs> so maybe you may be having some kind of opportunity to have this new beginning because it is not there in your life the ace of swords came out it is like new beginning you have that opportunity maybe now when you are watching this reading you may be having this opportunity this new beginning very honest truthful clear transparent new beginning there is no deception there is no lies nothing is there everything is clear transparent as sky as like there is no clouds nothing there is no deception nothing you have that chance of that new beginning and maybe this person is also very honest person very trustworthy person but here they are like a father figure as i said they may be want to offer that cup of love to you they may, they may be want to be in this part of this 10 of pentacles because i think they already have this 10 of pentacles they already hold some kind of big organization or at least their family is well known family where their generations are known so you may be have chance of entering into this family in this 10 of cups family sorry 10 of pentacles family so they want to offer this cup of love to you but i think you are leaving behind this opportunity this opportunity i want to call because this is new beginning ace of swords is new beginning it is not there in your life currently it is not there it is a new beginning you may be receiving this new beginning in your life or you have this opportunity opportunity of this new beginning but i think you are not accepting this opportunity because you are leaving this opportunity in the 2022 maybe you may be having different reasons because here things are very good this person is also like a king of cups energy very caring person and very loving person as i said they are not like king of pentacle or king of wands because king of pentacle means they know only materialistic things they don't know how to show love and care and king of wands is they know only passion they don't know what is love and care king of swords is also like they are have that leadership system you need to do that you need to do that <laughs> these are systematic things everything they want they follow some kind of rules and regulation i am that kind of person <laughs> i want I, no i don't insist people but i follow and they will follow me <laughs> i won't insist them i won't compel them my mom feel little bit uh problematic with me because she is reckless i am very strict like a army person so they friends also tell that your daughter is like a army woman she always have a lot of rules and regulations <laughs> so maybe it is not that kind of person it is like loving caring person they allow you to do whatever you want they won't control you they love you but i and moreover they are very well settled person well settled family or at least uh, professionally they are very grounded they are very much settled grounded so you no need to even when you get into this family i don't think you need to work for money if at all you want to work also you need to work for passion to fulfill your passion not for money just to 
if at all you have desire to work they will allow you to work so that to fulfill your passion because i don't think this person will control you or to tell you to not do they will leave you whatever you want to do they will allow you to do whatever you want that freedom will be there and this uh, ten of pentacle family also as i said you no need to worry about financial financial materialistic things they are very much grounded family so that is what i said if at all you want to work also that work should that profession also for your passion not for the money you need to work for passion that's it not for the money and uh, whatever this i mean maybe you are going to receive such kind of match if at all you are a unmarried person looking for um, matches relationship so this is opportunity some kind of new beginning opportunity but you are leaving this behind i don't know why you are leaving it is a trustworthy relationship you no need to worry if at all you have any kind of doubts pile number 4 if at all you have any kind of doubts any kind of uh is like fears about this family or about this person listen to me this person is honest person okay and as i said maybe some you may be fearing of this family maybe they are going to control you and all because this i don't know about family but this person will allow you to do whatever you want to do okay they won't control you they love you even though you fit all you are doing something shitty also they will understand you that's why i said loving caring father figure okay they are not going to punish you they are not going to scold you they will show that love and care because they will understand you why you are behaving in that way okay that's why it is a father figure and for money also you don't need to worry about it and whatever match if at all you are going to receive this match don't keep any kind of fears about this match because ace of swords is like honesty trustworthy so you can trust this beginning whatever beginning you may be having here you no need to keep any kind of doubts any kind of fears can because ace of swords itself is a clear clarity truth complete truth honest truth so this match will be with a lot of honesty this person also very honest person so whatever will be there they will be clear with that they are not hiding anything they are not going to hide anything so why are you are leaving behind this match i don't know because it's a good thing now you know the reasons why you are leaving this behind maybe when you are watching this reading you have this opportunity in your hand that's why it came out you are leaving behind in 2022 so think about it one more time because here everything is happening in a honest way and moreover you will be having this love cup of love and pentacle also so love pentacle will be there maybe you are a passionate person then <laughs> look for some other match <laughs> because here i am not finding that passion okay so if at all you are a young person then you can look for some other match because this person is father figure as i said okay but they have a wand also king of cups with wand think about it why you are leaving behind because still there is a time for 2022 to end no miss the opportunities let's move on to pile number 5 which is blue pile so pile number 5 what you are leaving behind in 2022 So pile number 5 who choose blue pile here the zodiac signs are Sagittarius Aries Scorpio Sagi Aries and Scorpio so what you are leaving behind is you are leaving you are healing why you are leaving you are healing maybe you are healed completely or you are simply leaving you are maybe you <laughs> is like it is a good thing some whatever other things is there it is good things maybe you have someone in your life like a healer 
this temperance card is like a healer someone in your life like a healer they are healing you they are providing healing to you or they are keeping you in balance because temperance is like balancing card also they are keeping you in balance i think you may be with this person you may be in the third party situation because three of wands came out and here three of cups spirit milk is there so here this healer is you have this healer maybe you may be having some other options also that is also one reason this third party situation because here three of cups also okay so you may be getting some new love in your life which is not third party or you may be no need to be in a third party situation because this is completely a third party situation really if at all you are not dealing with any third party watch other way okay because i don't think this is matching to you because here you are in third party situation and you are simply waiting for that person to come maybe they are your healer you are feeling like having this person in your life is good because they are balancing you so that is also one reason you may be waiting for that person but the thing is balancing you is a different thing because of that person you are not enjoying your life you are not having that happy life in your life because you are always crying over that spirit milk maybe you already dealt with this person if this may be your past person uh, your ex person and uh, this person is like a healer or at least for you in the sense in the normally they may be not a healer but you for you whenever you used to be with them you feel like a healer okay you feel like whenever you are used to talk with them whenever you spend time with them you feel like healing the kind of energy so they will soothe your soul they will help you to uh, come out of your uh, sadness they will help you to come out of your uh, uh, stressful nature because here you are a very three of wands energy very fine passionate person okay uh, so maybe you would take lot of tension because of the stress means you want to do something you want to achieve something there are a lot of goals ambitions and all because of that career oriented especially okay maybe because of that you feel a lot of stress in your life and this person make you feel comfortable or peaceful because they know how to balance it at least in the sense of emotions when you feel stress they will bring that peace in your life but the thing is here i think they kept you in the third party or you kept them in the third party so here you are simply crying over something maybe you left this person is not there in your life currently okay why because here you are waiting and you are crying over spilt milk so you are completely in the sadness now you are not enjoying your life even though you have two cups in your life you may that's why i said it is a three party situation because in here you are waiting for this healer to come in your life this person is no more in your life maybe there is a reason why they came into your life to show something now when they left you you are crying over that spirit mean are three people are involved because here completely different energies like see this temperance is completely a healer who know how to balance the things they are very much balanced with their emotions they are very intuitive person they are a healer okay that's why i always say two is good three is crowdy at least for me it is crowdy i don't even understand whose energy is who what they are thinking it is completely clumsy clumsy this okay <laughs> one is three of wands waiting because third party maybe you are currently there is no partners with you you are completely single and you are waiting who is who will come towards you so that i can have that person whoever come towards you you will have that person and your other person is completely in the sadness even though they have to walk up in their life they are completely in the sadness they are simply crying over spirit mind or whatever happened in their past that past things that's why i said it is like one person is very balanced one person don't know how to be in this present moment how to enjoy the life how to appreciate the things in their life and one person is completely in the waiting mode 
they don't want to take any action they simply want to wait to see who are who is going to come that's why i said it is like a third party situation maybe you are the one who is waiting take the messages as it resonates here i cannot say which energy is you okay so here i will take you as a three of ones so here you are dealing with two people one is a healer one is a sad sad person <laughs> one is a pessimistic person okay they have their own problems they don't know how to let go of the past and you don't know how to take action okay you are simply waiting and uh, this person is very much balanced they may be busy in their life and here i think two people are wasting their time <laughs> okay this three things are leaving behind in your 2022 you are leaving this healing or healer you are leaving this healer you are leaving this waiting period you are not going to wait anymore and you are leaving this five of cups person whoever they may be you are you are dealing maybe you are dealing because three three but i think whoever this five of cups they are also dealing with someone it is it is like a messy messy situation it is like a very messy situation so finally anyway what you are leaving behind in 2022 is you are leaving this messy situation you are completely leaving this messy kind of situation you are leaving everything if at all you are healing anything you are leaving that you are in third party you are leaving that you are no more waiting for anyone you just don't want to wait for anyone if at all you are dealing with someone who is this pessimistic you are leaving that person also you are simply leaving all these things in your life maybe you are starting your next year in a new way without depending on anyone without having partner <laughs> okay <laughs> this company is a different on our situation but it it is here it is completely messy mess is there lot of this person is trying over three of cups even though they already have two of cups now they are already have love in their life then why you are why they are crying for the three of cups third party situation means they are also having someone but they are don't want to care about they don't they are simply crying over past issues they can leave the situation and they can have that love in their life they are not doing it that's why it said they don't know how to let go of the things and you are there you can take action go and get what you want in there in your life instead of doing you are simply waiting to see who is going to come whether this healer will come whether this five of cups person will come you don't want to do anything you just want to wait and see because you know that either one definitely one person will come who will come you don't know <laughs> okay who will come you don't know but you know that one person will come hmm? and this healer whoever this healing energy they are very much balanced very much busy in their life they are healer maybe they are a doctor they are healer or they may be simply doing their work so it is that's why i said it is a messy situation so anyway you are living this messy situation whatever going to happen next in the 2023 i don't know but finally in the 2022 you are living this messy situation you are coming out of this messy situation okay So thank you for watching for more readings you can like and subscribe for personal readings you can mail me you will find the details in the description box